the Thunder Spark Nursery is next. This is a 1 mile 0 to 90 handicap for two year olds on the dirt. And at the top, we've got Buck Rogers for Paul Rhodes, Land of the Mad for Joshua Sutherland, Goal Hanger Daniel French, Anna Popovich, Martin Leedham, Ivanhoe, Padre Hogan, Pure White, Derek Hinton, Fear in the Night, Leon Van Rensburg, Non Blondes, Derek Hinton, Pity Me for Graham Clutterbuck, Bauble and Royal Wolf for Adam Mould, Fortune Ahead, David Hooley, Moonlight Flicks, Padre Hogan, Snow in the Street, Martin Leedham, Gifted and Southern Addiction for Obi Wan, Classic Arch, Alex Cherry, Blue Cheese, Matt Cooper, who's also got Ortia Bouquet, 19 two year olds on the dirt. I think that might need sorting out. An extra two year old race next season, maybe. And away they go. And well, two of these were caught wide, are really going to struggle, I think. But uh, over on the inside rail, Land of the Mad and Gifted are a close up. So too is Anna Popovic. Now Gifted has gone on for. Obi Wan has been immediately challenged by Gold Hanger and Blue Cheese, as there's about seven or eight of them who've gone clear of the rest. And I would suggest that it might well be these that the winner comes from. But it's Gifted who's in the lead then from Land of the Mad in second. Gold Hanger is in third. Pure White the Grey is up there as well. So too Non Bronze and Buck Rogers. Anna Popovic just towards the back of that group. Or Tia Bouquet and Pity Mia next. And towards the back, Classic Arch is the back marker. And Fortune Ahead is the one widest on the track as they come into this next turn and it's gifted who's in the lead by about three lengths two blue cheese and white ted then comes land of the mad goal hanger book rogers are after that one in towards the back snow in the street is now the back marker but it's gifted who's got the lead gifted is clear by two lengths from book rogers who's now burst through in the second then comes land of the mad non bronze after that blue cheese goal hanger and a pop of it is trying to get going so too he's all tier bouquet pure white has lost its place snow in the street is running around the outside on the car park but it's gifted who's still in the lead from non blondes in second then comes Buck Rogers blue cheeses after that one gold hanger and a pop of it I know there's plenty of them not got into this race at all as they come down towards the final furlong it's gifted who's in front now being pressed again by Buck Rogers and Buck Rogers suddenly bursts into the lead it's Buck Rogers in the lead from gifted the fast finishing Ivanhoe is after that one Buck Rogers and Ivanhoe you couldn't make it up blue cheese between them and <laughs> Buck Rogers wins it well there you go what about that Buck Rogers and Ivanhoe separated only by Blue Cheese. You could not make that up. A steward's inquiry. I'm not surprised at the steward's inquiry. There's sure to be a steward's inquiry into how that was allowed to happen. Buck Rogers is the winner <laughs> for Paul Rhodes. Blue Cheese was second for Matt Cooper, who's having a great season. Ivanhoe was third for Patrick Hogan. Fear in the night for Leon Van Rensburg. Definitely fear in the night for me. I'm going to commentate on some of these names. And then, what was the horse that came fifth? Well, what else could it possibly be? But Land of the Mad, because that's what we all must be in. Joshua Sutherland was fifth. A long time leader, gifted for everyone was next. I'm going to take weaker tablets tomorrow. And hopefully we'll be back to do some more commentaries. I'll see you tomorrow.